You want to have 60 Hz on, on your always on display, but when you unlock it, you have 120 Hz. And when you stop scrolling, it's 60 Hz. As you can see. And this is a S21 FE and it, it does not support adaptive refresh rate. So, let's see how we can make it support. And this works on all Samsung uh, devices that have a 120 Hz uh, display. Make sure you smash that like button and please watch the video till the very end because uh, every step counts and please like and subscribe because it helps the channel and it will uh, help more people uh, uh, see the video so they also know how to unlock uh, this feature. Uh, so you're gonna go into settings and type unknown in the apps, you can see it's apps, install unknown apps. And you're gonna hit install unknown apps and you're gonna hit chrome here you're gonna uh, enable it so just enable it next thing you're gonna want to do is uh, search for usb no you're gonna want to uh, enable developer options so you're gonna go into about phone then you're gonna go into software information and then build number and you're gonna tap on the build number seven times. For me it's saying you're already a, de a developer, but for you it will say you're not a developer. And then you're gonna go back and you will see these developer options here. Okay. And now we're gonna unlock, uh, we're gonna turn on USB debugging and that's all the things you need to do. And now we're gonna head on to the computer or if you're, if you have an older Galaxy phone, you're gonna uh, download the app uh, uh, on via the link. Now let me just uh, get to the app. It is called Galaxy Max first. You're gonna type that into Google. Is this one? Here we have assets, Galaxy Max first. I already downloaded, but you can see file downloaded. And you're gonna hit OK. If it, if you don't have OK, that means you have uh, uh, Android 14, and uh, it won't work on the app. But you have to install it uh, via the computer. So if you can install it, install it. If you cannot, uh, then just Okay, next you're gonna head on to this website, uh, GitHub Tribal FS Max Galaxy Max Hertz Pub, and it will the link will be in the description. Here it says all the things you can do, and at the very end, it says downloads and rate secure settings. You're gonna uh, middle click on both. It will open uh, these two uh, windows, and first you're gonna write in this command into here you have uh, under number three you can you hit more and adb platform tool hit the windows it will download it just extract it to your desktop already have mine extracted and also uh, download the uh, v point v8.1 uh, apk it will be under assets on the other link under this link downloads okay and then just download it already download it and just put it in the same folder you put the platform tools okay next you're gonna write cmd here on the address bar that will pop up and you're gonna go back and write this command adb shell and copy it and make sure you you have your device connected and USB debugging enabled so just connect it unlock it uh, and then under USB select uh, USB tethering and allow always allow you can say hit always allow uh, just hit allow next uh, type in that command just paste it 
and if nothing happens that means it's good that means the command went through and next here you're gonna type adb devices and if you see here unauthorized for me it says device because i did everything correctly if you see unauthorized type that command again and make sure you have allowed on your uh, phone that you have allowed the uh, USB debugging and everything uh, like that and uh, next we're gonna install the app via the so don't close this we're gonna install the apps so just go back here and as you can see ADB install bypass target and your you need to have the APK name just like this or name it uh, or edit, edit the command so it's if you if it says number two here then add that into the command and just paste the command like so like so and just hit enter and see performing stream installed success and now on my device I should see Galaxy Max Hertz and just continue check for update no no update anyway uh, and for you're gonna see the option but you already have adapter set because I had the app before but you're gonna, you're not gonna have to you're not gonna be able to uh, press any of these just yet we're gonna as you can see perform ADB procedure to enable disabled settings and uh, we're gonna type in that first command again so write secure settings so ADB shell grant blah 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 type that in and hit enter and just like that I can now enable adaptive on my un, uh, unsupported device and uh, yeah and also what you can do the app is only free for two days uh, so and I highly recommend you guys uh, uh, pay three dollars for the app because it's just three dollars and it's a huge feature and uh, things you're gonna want to do to make sure uh, it works is uh, switching quick setting shortcut refresh rate monitor I already have that enabled you can enable it for refresh rate monitor in, in the uh, developer options uh, just like I have here as you can see it's working 120 Hertz I stopped scrolling 60 Hertz and also you can enable these I enabled uh, these uh, uh, settings because and this is one you want really want screen screen off always on display refresh rate 60 Hertz because uh, quick setting shortcut and I have the refresh rate monitor okay so that's all you need quick setting shortcut that's all you need and to check it if it works like I said you need to go into developer options and uh, sure refresh rate just enable that and you will see now this now it's working and you also have these cool things like you can see the uh, speeds of your device uh, how fast is downloading how fast is uploading and when you lock your phone it takes a few seconds in the uh, always on display but when you lock your phone it will be uh, 60 Hertz after like 10 seconds and then it will remain 60 Hertz and yeah that's all uh, thanks for watching please uh, like i said share the video with your friends so they also ha have this amazing feature and uh, like the video subscribe as you can see it went to 60 it will stay 60 as long as the always on the herd display is on and yeah thanks for watching